What's up everybody? How you doing? I'm out here in nature enjoying the sunshine. It's beaming on me so you know I'm going to get me a nice little tan going but I wanted to talk about something because I'm, I'm pumped up. I finished my run. I've been doing my cardio and my high intensity intervals training workouts. I feel super fit and all that good stuff but since my, my heart is charged up I can give you a very heartfelt message because we need to talk on a heart level right now. Shout out to everybody joining me. Thank you for joining me. I know you could be anywhere doing anything, but you come in here and give me your energy today. It means a lot. It really means a lot. And I want to acknowledge the LaMonica, um, Giovanna, my Gemini. What's up to my womb sisters? William, thank you for joining me, William. Thank you for joining me. Um, Veronica, shout out to you. These designs, my earrings and my necklace, she made these things, okay? This was my family, my soul family I got connected to in Mobile, Alabama. And thank you so much. Shout out to Myron Collins, the master barber that did my hair and cut my hair, which was such a, a phenomenal journey for me. But I'm not going to be out here long, guys. Because the sun is beaming down and you know when your phone gets hot, it will cut off on you. But I want to tell you something. Go for broke. Go for broke. I had a mentor tell me that when I was 18 years old, he was a man that had been um, in the Marines. He had been married, divorced, had a lot of kids, and he had a lot of regret. And he was one of the real people that put me on the right path and told me what to do and what not to do. But one of the things he told me as I was trying to find my career path and where to go, <laughs> what to do he told me to go for broke like go for broke do shit like you don't care you know any idea that you want to do it was at the time this girl that was standing on the corner and had a um a poster board out that was said what her resume was and just people that do off the wall shit for a job people that's doing off the wall shit right now just for attention on social media we got people licking ice cream and shit just for attention whoring this is a go for broke type of mentality, but we're using it the wrong way. You need to have that same mentality for the shit that you're doing. For example, when I was in Mobile, one thing that I got was that we have some very scary Negroes all over. And being that I'm from Birmingham, Alabama, I know that's a place where a lot of Negroes, honey, they scared to even curse. They scared to not go to church on Sunday. Just every little thing. Every fucking little thing, you know. And I'm, be and I'm there and I'm listening to people and I'm seeing all of these talented people. Because one thing I did come away with, what I understood, was that Mobile is a very frustrated for the Negro. It's the place where you go and you get family, you get rooted or whatever that is. But it's a lot of spirit of the slaves that want to get out. It's a lot of that I want to get out of here spirit. So within that, you have a community of people that have so much frustration built up. So much greatness trapped inside of them. I mean, those motherfuckers don't even talk to each other in the street. You talk to a black person in Atlanta, it's, hey, what's up, boom, boom, blah, 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 blah. It's a different wavelength. It's a different energy. And even for y'all that are in Atlanta that may be on a fucked up wavelength, you may not know what I'm talking about. You may not have seen the beauty and glory of Atlanta. But most people have. But it's not like that in Mobile. They're very scared there. You talk to a black person, you don't know, they look at you like, what you talking to me for? That type of shit. But yet and still you want to do business. Yet and still you don't know why you're struggling. Yet and still we don't know why you're broke. Yet and still, we don't know why we're economically in the toilet as a people. We're afraid as a people. We're afraid to do anything. We're afraid of going against what our mamas, our cousins, and whatever's going to say. Tonight, what I wanted to talk to my womb sisters about, I'm going to be doing a call because I'm looking for womb school ambassadors. And this is a paid opportunity. This is not no Mary Kay shit. This is not no MLM shit. I don't believe in all of that. I believe in Ujama. I believe in cooperative economics, and I believe that every time I get paid from a sale, you should get a referral. What the fuck is hard about that? See, I'm talking about going for broke, meaning go do the idea you want to do. Do shit you ain't never thought about doing. Stop overthinking stuff. You're really, really overthinking and overworking your idea. You're overworking it. I'm not going to overwork any ideas. You have to go out in that path and act as if everything that you need and all the people you need, the resources you need, you're going to get. And a lot of times we're overcomplicating things. Tonight I'm going to teach people how to make money just by posting on Facebook. you on Facebook all the time anyway. You need to learn something called a sales funnel. You're talking all the time. You're, you're missing wonderful opportunities to create 
a niche market for yourself and to create a network that does become your net worth. You've heard that. Your net worth becomes your net worth. You're creating a real database. How are people making thousands and thousands of dollars a month on Facebook? If you got a mentality that, oh, well, I tried it and it didn't work. <clears throat> what we're going to be talking about tonight is one thing I know you're going to deal with when you start posting and talking about talking like you got some sense and talking like you're a real businesswoman and businessman. It's going to bother your simple-ass environment. It's going to bother your simple-ass friends. You, you're you going to be wondering how to react to people asking questions when you do put up things about herbs and take these herbs for fibroids, do this for better heart health, reverse diabetes with these herbs, reverse heart disease here, reverse cancer here. You're going to be making posts like that, and you're going to have people that just want to talk and just talk, 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 and not want to do anything, and they're going to be pissed that you're doing and what you're doing, and, oh, well, I don't need this, and is this worth it? And it's going to be all types of shit that come up. So you got to already know right now, decide you're going to be that chick. Decide you're going to be that boss bitch. Decide right now that you're about to go for broke, and you're not going to give a fuck what nobody says. You're not going to give a fuck if it's raggedy. You're not going to give a damn because you're going to be happy that you just did it. Because by doing it, that puts you ahead of the game about at least 80 to 90 percent because the average person is just afraid. The average person is just afraid to do it. You guys, I'm going to be doing the high intensity intervals training workouts in Atlanta. That's something I haven't done one on one. I don't really like to do a lot of events like that. I do retreats. I've done retreats. I've done a lot of events in the past. But right now, I've kind of gotten into the lane where I don't have to leave my house. And so now it's like, why don't we make sense, black people? Let's let's teach you how to do this sales funnel. You wonder how people are doing it all around you. I like to just break it down. I'm not a church girl. I'm not an MLM girl. I don't have Mary Kay. This ain't no links. This ain't no five links. This is none of that. You see I sell books. You see I have detox programs for sale. I'm about to come out with my cookbook next month and my cooking courses. All of these things, when you posting my stuff and reposting my stuff and sharing my stuff, if you want to put at the top for info, contact me so that we can track it. I will give you a cut of that. I'm like, why the fuck are we not profit sharing? This is so easy. So if you're interested in this, you can type info. If you're in the womb school, you already know we're going to have this call tonight. This is a group coaching call tonight for womb school ambassadors. For people that want to be an ambassador to the womb school, why? You know, you have to utilize the efforts and the energy of others. Delegate. We can do this as a community and a sisterhood. Cooperative economics. Our people are sick. You know, it's a lot of information that people need. It's a lot of information people need about herbs, how to reverse this. Everybody you know goddamn sick. Why not send them where you know they're going to get help and you get a referral off of it? God damn. How, how, how hard is that? And so it's going to be some people that's going to go for broke and say, fuck it, I'm going to just try what she's talking about. I'm going to listen to what she's doing. You're going to go for broke and do it. And it's a lot of you that's going to do it. You're going to be on a call tonight, and you're already going to be deciding that you can't do this because you've already been defeated in your brain. You haven't. You don't know how easy it is to make this money. Now, the Asians know how easy it is. These white people know how easy it is. All the YouTube children, all this, this technology generation, everybody making money online and social media. And I'm sitting up here a straight-up example of how to do this shit. I know we can have more if we just get a system and get organized and have somebody that says, hey, use my resources. Let's come up together. This is what I like about being in Atlanta. This is a this is a spirit of put each other on. Let's put each other on. If you don't want to see each other win, this is not gonna be for you already. Let me let me tell you that right now. This is a I'm about me, 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 and this is what I'm doing. You're gonna miss it because you, you don't see community. And there is really no I in team. It's not about me. It's not about selling my products. This is about sharing information people need. The African needs to know that over 600,000 hysterectomies are done in the U.S. every year. And 78% are on black women. 78% are on black women. Black women got fibroids. Black people are dealing with cancer, diabetes. Somebody just tagged me in a post the other day. A little girl has diabetes. What can we do? Well, thankfully, somebody tagged me and said, Art knows what to do. Well, this person's post... He follows me all the time. He sees all my videos, all my information. But how is it that you don't know to just send them where they need to go? And what, what about getting a piece of that and profiting from that and knowing that the family can do the same thing? Helping people. Like, this is just this.
just the way I've been able to create a, a good life for myself and be able to go to my phone and use it as an ATM just by helping people. Help people. Go for broke. Don't be ashamed. I'm not ashamed that my face is sweating right now because I know the average person is afraid to do this. Some of y'all haven't even done a video yet. You wondering about, oh Lord, I don't look right now. Uh -uh, I've I, I just, I've run out of room to be afraid. I don't, I don't do fear anymore because it's the energy. It's the energy that speaks for itself. It's the energy that's going to do this for you. So again, I'm looking for womb school ambassadors. People that's not afraid to come together as a cooperative and a collective and, and practice cooperative economics. A lot of you have businesses that you have on your own. And as I told Veronica, you need to open yourself up to the broad worldwide web. People need to see this. Some of you are the most talented people ever. And you still wonder, well, what do I need to do to make extra money for myself? You know, that type of shit. And you got all of these talents and gifts and this and that, but you're afraid to post it. You're afraid to make that, you know, that step and that bold statement to say, I'm serious about what I'm doing because you're afraid of what your mom and your daddy, all those sad, sorry, basic ass people. You're afraid of what they're going to say. And you need to be around some people who are going to be going forth and doing their thing. So you, you can be in that wavelength too because it's a very scary energy going around. Y'all hear that? Oh my goodness. Wow, ancestors. I hear y'all. It's usually the birds, but we got the crickets or whatever that is. Okay, they calm down. If you have questions about this, about how to monetize your ideas, you know, this is this is what we need to be talking about right now. There is nothing wrong with seeing yourself more than what you are. There is nothing wrong with seeing your greatest dreams come true because that can happen. Y'all see me going through a healing journey. I'm going through all of the things that a regular person goes through, going through life. But you have to use it as a resource. Everything I'm experiencing, I'm transmuting. This is alchemy turning, you know, shit to sugar. That's what you have to do and, and utilizing the opportunity in front of you. Your phone that you have right now. The resources that you have go to fiverr.com you can be designing your book cover you can be writing your book you can start your pre-sales you can do a cookbook you can do videos you can do whatever you want to do but you're not going to be able to do it around people that have a scary mentality if you don't have a go for broke mentality this is going to miss you this message is going to miss you being in mobile it was it I, I listen to people talk about simple business concepts and just completely get in their way with each idea, they say, oh, but they wouldn't let me do this. Oh, but I went to this and I asked them, da 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 da, da. I'm like, you going and asking the powers that be to give you license to go do this and do that? I know people that's selling plates right now out their house. She didn't go to the board of health and ask nobody. Because she, I like, yo, y'all mobile phones don't know the spirit of the grind and the hustle. You waiting, you waiting. Something you already talented at doing, you going to the man asking him to give you a license and a certificate and and and, and then they did it and, and you mad, man. See, that's why I can't do nothing. Oh God. It says go around, go another way. Baby, when they don't let you in the front though, go in the back though. And when they don't let you in the back though, bust a motherfucking window. If you're in the womb school, we posted the phone number for the call. So um, yeah. Pay attention to that because I want you to be on this call. But I'm like, we got this real whiny spirit. I see some people in here where I've crossed your path in the past and you had a whiny spirit just defeated. Get away from them defeated people. Defeated. I've been in the most defeated fucking state of all. And I'm going to name it as Alabama, goddamn. Them the most defeated black people I have ever seen in my life. And thank God I at least had a handful of that was cool, but we even talked about that. I even was checking in. I'm like, damn, you so great and brilliant. You don't know it. You didn't just got into this. I can't. You done fucked around with a sash that's a free slave from Atlanta. I think about how it can be done. I'm thinking the glasses have full, and I'm thinking about, yeah, how we do this. This can be done today. Y'all got business concepts. Y'all been sitting on for five fucking years, 15 years, because you scared. No, it's time out for that. Time out for that. 
If you have questions, I want you guys to reach out. You're going to see me do a lot of things. I throw a lot of things at the board. You got to be unafraid to do that. Some things are going to catch, some things aren't. But it needs to be in a spirit of just expressing yourself. You can monetize all your ideas, all the things that inspire you, all the things that you like to do. Fulfill your destiny. Get in the path of what you enjoy. Get in the path of what you can do to help people raise up their, their standards in life. How can you serve humanity with the things you enjoy? How can you get quiet and get still and start to think about, hmm, this is where I need to be. How do you center yourself? It's so, pe so many people that's just scattered. You're scattered. You don't know what it is you like to do. That type of stuff. It's a lot you got to break through in order to even be able to be re ready for this type of message to go for broke, to make a post and make money off Facebook every day. Some of you are going to look and find fault with this and, and think that I'm, I'm a scam artist. It's, that's okay. We got a lot of niggas that's scary and that's thinking like that. A lot of y'all probably Christians and shit. And a lot of y'all probably hoteps that's so used to being dusty and broke that you not, you know, you don't want to hear this. But there is very much a group of people. Thankfully, I've been able to meet a lot of these people that are just cranking it out online with online, different online products and services and the game of making money online and running an online business is very, very real. Create a sales funnel. And in short, before I go, a sales funnel, this is the information you get from somebody in order to convert that to a sale later and creating your database. That's a sales funnel. It says everybody, think of a funnel. Funneling everybody into one place. Where are you taking them? Okay, they saw your video. What's next after the video? There needs to be a link. Where are you leading them to next? You see what I'm saying? That's also called an upset. You know, so we need to learn this. I've been in the sales game for a long time, but technology and social media, it has helped me level up, but I'm still learning so much stuff every day. And the more I learn, the more I want to share it with people. But when I learn new things, I like to share it. And when I see something so easy, I see y'all missing opportunities to create sales funnels every day. People are online just making posts for whatever. And you're not using it how it can really be used. This is an opportunity for you to create a real platform for yourself to learn how to use content, create content for a purpose. We need to learn how to write. We need to learn some sales writing, some headline writing, a lot of stuff. We don't even know how to make basic um, effective and, and impactful posts. We need to learn how to do that. And if you're ready to learn, if you if you know a know-it-all woman, and oh, please go on. I'm not, I, no. Time out for that. People steady wondering why our economic shit is in the toilet, but we don't even know how to work together and collaborate. We want to take over. If you got the spirit of the takeover, you want them black women, this is not for you. I'm looking for room school ambassadors. This has been done over and over again. You do it for Amway. You do it for Five Links. You do it for Mary Kay. You do it for all of these other damn groups and all of these people. This is a real opportunity. I'm not MLM. I'm not Christian. I'm not with some weird sales shit. I may even be a little bit too simple for you, to be honest. Okay, because I don't like to hem and haul all day. You can use my shit, but know how to funnel it right back to you so that you can share profit in this. And I'm going to teach you guys how to do that. Um, shout out to Tyron, Tyron um, Spear. He's an admin in the womb school. He's taught me how to triple my book sales online. He showed me this formula um, years ago, and it, and it blew my mind, and it helped me create income for myself, and it's such an easy formula. I just want to share it and gush all my game to you, all this free game to you. I want to give it, okay? So thank you guys for joining me. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out. If you want to get on tonight's call, you need to first join the womb school, okay? Join the womb school, and then we can get you on the call, and, and you can become a womb school ambassador. If you are a man and you'd like to know more about this, you can reach out. We can talk one-on-one. -on -one and have a session but the talking in the inbox stuff I don't do that because I know how to manage my time and I, I'm just too busy for that and you need to know how to manage your time too we need to know how to do business you don't reach out and want to hold up somebody's time all damn day because it's just oh I just want to talk to her oh she she responded oh I'm not doing that okay it's only one or two things you can do we can set up time to talk and have a one-on-one -on -one session so you can talk about how you'd like to create an authentic, successful brand. I can help you do that based on your natural gifts and talents. That's what we need to learn how to do. So I have sessions for that. If you'd like to reach out on that level, and if you want to become a womb school ambassador and it's real money, every time I sell something, you get a kickback. When I sell a $20 book, you get five, that type of shit. So we can get this money up and that really does, oh Lord, if y'all only knew. 
So um, I, I'm, I'm over, you know, keeping this information. I've been wanting to do this for a long time. It just hasn't come up until now. So um, if you have any questions about this, feel free to reach out. Thank you for sharing my videos. Share this video. If you know somebody that needs a real business opportunity and they tired of going to these dumbass meetings, I'm not going to have meetings with y'all all the time either. I'll have a once a week call for the Women's School of Ambassador, but that's going to be it. All them meetings and shit like that, I've, I've learned a long time ago in MLM. If you're doing all them meetings, ain't nobody making money. If you got time to do all these meetings, you don't, you're not making enough money. It's, that's not a real opportunity. And so for me, when I'm looking at any business opportunity, I qualify it like this. What's the product? Am I passionate about the product? And what's the compensation structure? Is it, is it a product people need? If you're telling me, <coughs> what is some dumb shit? They got these little widgets and shit selling against you now or whatever the fuck it is. Honey, if that's not something I resonate with, I can't fuck with it. That's just me. That's me. But now fibroid health, womb health, STD detox, cancer, diabetes, losing weight, shit. How did the African get sick psychologically, physically, mentally? I mean, we got books. We got services. We have a lot for this. So it's, you can get in where you fit in. But again, I'm going to give you guys an opportunity to be able to, to share in the profit. Every time one of those services are purchased, it's going to go to you. All you need to have is a cash app account or PayPal, goddammit. We're going to get your money to you. I'm over it. I'm done. Okay? Yes, 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 yes. I want I want to help you, too. Thank you so much, LaShonda. Thank you so much, all my womb sisters. We need a lot of work, y'all. Y'all, be ready to get some work tonight. I'm not... Don't make this harder than what it is. I'm going to give you some very basic things. Y'all know I be hyped up. I'm going to be on this phone call with y'all 30 minutes, and I'm going to make you... You know, we're going to go and do our thing, but it's nothing that you need to overthink. You just need to get a, a mindset about this. If you're not in the mindset where you're serious about yourself, if you're still nervous, honey, I don't have time for nervous women. I'm so sick of that goddamn energy. I don't know what to do. I don't know. Well, they had asked me if I, oh God, like that shit, baby, you almost fucking 40, 50 years old. This is why, like, that energy, I can't rock with that energy. I'm a Sag with a Pisces moon and a Virgo rising. So it's work, work, work with power, confidence. It can be done. And a Pisces can figure out how to be creative with the shit. So if you scary and timid and, well, I got a cakes that I like to bake, but I'm just, I don't know. And I, I've been trying. Okay, get yourself together. Get on the call and we finna do this. Go for broke. You don't have any more time, okay? And neither do I. I got to get ready. This call is at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. If you want to be on this call for a womb school ambassador, it's a real business opportunity. Be on the call tonight. Get in the womb school first, and it requires you buying the book. And there are womb school dues, $22 per month, okay? So it ain't no, no, what, what, I ain't no, you pay $40, $50, $60, you eating it, you putting it on your hair, baby. We got real game for your mind, your body, and your spirit. So if this is not for you, if you don't want to invest in yourself, this may not be for you. But that whole haggling with niggas back and forth about their money, I'm not going to do that. When you fr freely give it to all these people that don't give a fuck about you, you go to the China Man and the beauty supply stores and you freely give it to them. You go to the damn gas stations. You let them serve you behind bulletproof glass so you're not going to come to me and say, well, I don't have my $20. And <laughs> what, you, what do I get when I get no Don't do that. We, we don't have to do any of that. Okay? Because it's money being made out here. People are making moves. So when people go up to the top, you be like, oh, well, I saw what she was doing. You had an opportunity. This happens in Atlanta all the time. That's why I love living here. You know, it's Negroes like the ones in Mobile. They're not used to taking each other seriously. They're not used to black people being on or smart or brilliant. You know, it's some real ignorant niggas there. Very ignorant. So they don't, you know, but here in Atlanta, you can be at a wing bar lounge and you talking to somebody they look like a homeboy a homegirl that's a goddamn neurosurgeon that's a judge that's a person that does this 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 on youtube that's a person that does blah 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 this is the celebrity da, da, da. yeah i don't know who the fuck you're talking to I'm, I'm used to talking to people that's on and doing something when you're around a brilliant population of people you take each other seriously and you take yourself seriously so i would advise you to do that when you enter into business, if you don't think that the marketing just to black people and this market and being a black person in business is something you want to do, if you still holding your head down and wondering and still scared, honey, I don't know what to tell you.
I'm not going to tell you much. I'm not going to waste my time because I have had it with the scary Negroes. You need to level up right now. You need to do something more with your business. Those ideas you've had, you sitting down on because you think you need a bigger camera or better this or better that. Yeah, I'll be getting on my last nerves with that shit. Thinking you need stuff that you don't even need. So, let me get out of here. Shout out to you, um, Kia. I think she has a pop bar in Charlotte. Her and her husband, that's a black-owned popsicle bar. Bloop, bloop. And a new baby. I went to um, high school, the Alabama School of Fine Arts with her. She was a dance major. Shout out to you, Kia Lines, and thank you for joining me today. Black entrepreneurship. Go support Pop Bar in Charlotte. Now, now I got a roast. I fucking hate Charlotte. I won't be coming to goddamn Charlotte to get none of your Pop Bars. I fucking hate that place. But, you, but I love you, and I want people to support you, okay? I want people to support you. Ooh, child. And be open. And this is not for you. She said, use your computer. Yes. And I also want to tell people, use your computer, use your resources. That made me think about using the things in front of you and not overthinking. If you still thinking on that idea and you haven't made that first video, it's time for you to make that first video. If you need a supportive sisterhood of people that's going to be cheering you on, you need to get in the womb school because there's some people that were new to making videos and they doing a thing now. And, you know, you need to get used to being great. That's really what it is, too. I'm so sorry. People is 30, 40, 50, 60 years old and don't even know they great. That's what I had to see in Mobile. This, you didn't know this was fly? This was just sitting up in her house like, you didn't know this was fly? What's wrong with you? Oh. Lord have mercy. And I'm having to hear people come up with great concepts and talk themselves out of it and come up with every excuse why I can't work and all that type of uh, 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 uh. nope. Mm -mm. We're not doing that. So meet me on the call 7 p.m. tonight if you want to get a natal chart reading. It's 50% off for all cancers all month long. So you can get 50% off. So it's only $49 for you. Um, regular price $99. And if you want to talk about anything, if you want to get the pre-order for my cookbook, I'm going to be giving you the information for that soon. I'm getting that online house set up for you guys. So thank you for joining me. Thank you for supporting me because it's very, very important to have a real community of people that you cultivate. And I'm going to be teaching you guys how to cultivate your own databases too and use it as a sales funnel because that's what everybody's doing. That's what the power of social media is. And everybody's been wanting to know how to do it. Wasn't quite sure. You see people doing it. Da, 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 da. If you have an open mind, if you're positive, holler at me. But if you're negative and if you've already given up, I may not be the person for you. But God bless you anyway. Love you. Bye.